Hi friends, this is Sally. And in today's video, I want to share with you how easy it is to do meal prepping. I'm going to start off with a basic easy salad. And then I want you to stay with me to the end because I'm going to share with you two of my favorite salad dressing recipes. So let's get started. Let's go ahead and get into how to make a quick salad for meal prepping. This will save you time throughout the week. I like to go ahead and just grab cans of vegetables and whatever bean I'm going to use. In this salad today we're going to do garbanzo beans, some green beans, and then we're also going to do some peas and some carrots to go along with our salad. So I like to open up all the cans and then I like to go ahead and rinse everything out and then um, go ahead and we're gonna layer into the mason jars. First, we're gonna add our dressing. And as a tip, I like to use the wide mouth funnel because it helps to not make a mess. Then I'll put the wide mouth funnel into the mason jar and go ahead and load up my garbanzo beans, my peas, then my mixed green beans and corn for this, for this recipe. And then I like to go ahead and shred carrots for the week. It helps out for salads. You can put them in soups. You can do a lot of stuff with the shredded carrots. And I like to just go ahead and use my food processor and get that blended up and it's ready, ready to go for that. And then we're gonna go ahead and just put it right into the, into the mason jars. And then our lettuce. And they're going to put the lid on there and they're it's going to go into the refrigerator and we're going to use them for snacks or for dinner so this comes in really handy it helps to save money it helps you not be stressed out wondering what's for lunch or what's for dinner you just grab and go now that we have just completed our meal prepping salad let me share with you my two favorite easy recipes so let's jump in We are going to start off with cannellini beans. Did you know they originated in Peru? And they are used a lot in Europe. Cannellini beans come already packaged in liquid. I'm going to use the package here that I got at the store. They also come in cans. I'm going to go ahead and double up on the cannellini beans so I have extra dressing for the week. And then next I'm gonna go ahead and add sesame seed paste, which is called tahini. A lot of vitamins and minerals are in here and powerful antioxidants, and yes, a healthy fat to add to your diet. I'm gonna add two to three tablespoons to the mix into my food processor. I'm gonna give it some flavor with sun-dried tomatoes. I'm going to use the oil that's in here to help smooth up the dressing. And I did use some of the liquid from the cannellini bean as well to add to this. It's up to you. You put as much as you want in there and then turn that food processor on and blend it up smoothly and keep an eye on it and add more oil or more cannellini liquid as you go along. And then for some flavor, I like to put a little bit of garlic powder in the mix. And of course, that's up to you if you want to add some more to that. And then we're going to smooth it up in the food processor. And that's about it. Use this for salad dressings or dips for the week. Now, my other favorite is bell pepper hummus. Garbanzo beans. Lots of protein in there. I'm going to use a can and rinse it out and then add it to the food processor. And I'm going to like to make a little bit extra. And again, I'm going to use my raw tahini sesame seed butter to the mix. And in this recipe, I'm going to add some frozen garlic cubes, which I picked up in the freezer section at the store. And I like to date my extra supplies that I have in the pantry, just so I know. I'm going to go ahead and also use the oil from the roasted bell peppers to make this recipe just a little bit smoother. You can add more if you want to make it just a little more creamier. And that's it. Now you have your bell pepper hummus salad dressing. 
Hey, thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to grab the freebie that I have in the comments below. And I'll see you at the next video.